I'm Erin Conrad from Two Works For You. Here are today's top stories. The Tulsa Health Department says a Tulsa woman has tested positive for coronavirus. She is now the second confirmed case of COVID-19 here in Oklahoma. Those test results came back from the Oklahoma State Department of Health's laboratory. Officials say she recently traveled to Italy and is not related to the other case of COVID-19 here in the state. The Oklahoma State Department of Health says 10 cases are under investigation and those results are currently pending. And Life Church Pastor Craig Go Rochelle and Pastor Bobby Grunwald are still under self quarantine, but the two are expected to finish their quarantine sometime this week. The two decided to quarantine themselves after traveling to Germany for a conference two weeks ago where someone tested positive for the coronavirus. Organizers ended that conference early as a precaution. Both of the pastors say they are still healthy and feel okay. And the CDC is warning colleges and universities to hold off on study abroad trips right now. Schools including Loyola Chicago, State University of New York and the University of Oklahoma have all brought students back early from overseas. The New York and Chicago students are all currently under quarantine. And let's get a check of the forecast with meteorologist Kerrigan Chauvin. Well, we're seeing a mild evening and store temperatures falling into those mid to lower 60s by 8 p.m. Seeing a brief clearing happening overnight tonight as those winds shift out of the southeast. This is going to be ahead of storms on the way for your Wednesday morning. Now, the majority of the threat is going to be for Arkansas, but we are seeing that marginal risk for portions of eastern Oklahoma. Let's go ahead and track this out starting as early as 5 a.m. for southern Kansas by 6 a.m. dipping down toward the Grove community here in northeast Oklahoma out of of Oklahoma by 9 a.m. for your Wednesday morning. Now, as we head throughout your Wednesday afternoon, warming up into those mid 70s, a mix of sun and clouds is going to be on the way for your Wednesday evening, tracking another round of storms as we head into your Thursday. We have a full day of heating winds out of the south, providing necessary energy and heat to sustain thunderstorms for your Thursday evening. We see those begin to blossom as we head into around sunset for your Thursday. Let's go ahead and take a look at your 10 day Day forecast. Check out this warm up on the way upper 70s for Thursday afternoon before a cold front passes through, dropping us back into those 50s as we head into your soggy weekend ahead. As we take a look at next week, mid 60s for the first day of spring. Erin. Thanks, Kerrigan. That was a look at our digital update. Keep checking back for updates all throughout the day. I'm Erin Conrad. Two works for you.